Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today is gonna be a really fun, cute one. I got on my pink pants. That'll tell ya. We are decorating for Valentine's Day. So I'm so excited to take our existing decor and just to sprinkle in little touches of love to just cozy up our home for this season of love. So I'm gonna pan you guys around. Today we're just gonna decorate the living room, the kitchen, since I have like an open floor plan. We'll do the entryway. Um, we'll decorate that a little bit and then we will also decorate the playroom. That will come later on when Brooklyn gets home from school. But grab a cup of coffee or tea and either decorate with me or just sit back and relax. And I hope this gives you a lot of inspiration and ideas of home decor or things you can do to sprinkle that little touch of love in your home. So I have this moss, which is from Hobby Lobby. It looks very realistic that I typically keep up here. I'm just gonna take it down, give it a good dusting um, up here, and then we're gonna put that back up. Um, I'm just gonna be using multi-surface cleaner right now. Our mantle is like one of my favorite things in our home. It is from um, 1870. It is gorgeous, and um, when the boys meaning my dad and my, my stepdad and my husband, when they built out our fireplace, it just like, it was just the icing on the cake. So I'm gonna wipe the mantle down and then get this up and then try to figure out what I wanna do. I'm using this Daisy Spray from Mrs. Myers. Typically, I don't like floral scents, but it actually smells really good. Standing underneath the lights Look into each other's eyes Tired snowflakes are coming down Collapse into water when they hit the ground I hear the sound of empty streets and Yesterday has gone to sleep that's left is you and me I can promise you're the only thing I see Hold my hand and hear the words I say Close your eyes and let us fade away Build a secret place for you and me Let our minds be caught up in a dream So view, it is so cute. I think it did so good. It looks like a fill to hearts like I wanted. So perfect. Okay, living room is done. We kept it sweet and simple. We just added a heart. And this is a candle from a local um, market here where I live in Dallas, Texas. So um, we have that. It's actually a peppermint scent, but it's so sweet. It smells glorious. And then we have our Be Mine pillow from um, Amazon, the pillow cover from Amazon, and then our fireplace mantle, which is a girl's fave. So just Valentine's Day ambiance. You can just throw that on your TV. I did my field of hearts, so various hearts. It's totally DIY project. Just buy some cardstock from the store, and there you go. The brown hearts, those were pre-cut. I bought them in a pack from Michael's. And then we have our little love banner and just very cute, easy, and simple. And guys, I absolutely love it. Okay, we're gonna move on to the kitchen area and then we're gonna tackle the front end. Everything that I pulled out that I think I wanna use in our kitchen, um, I made a video that told you guys where I picked up everything. 
but um, I picked up this weekend these little uh, from that same shop I got the candle they're called love spell they're so pretty it can't focus but right there there you go these little wax melts so I'm gonna use those and then I'll put the cotton candy ones in my drawer these ones I got from Target um, but yeah, this is just a little bit of going to sprinkle in the kitchen. I also am going to do the hutch that's over here. That's our box. And then I need to do the entryway as well. So let's tackle the kitchen. Look out, here she comes. The woman that I love. It's too bad she'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be Cause I hope that I'm not showing her How I feel for her she won't feel the same for me I've got this picture in my mind It's just the two of us Just the two of us But I know I have to try Try to let her go Because she won't be mine So here's my kitchen, let's do the walkthrough we just have this little love sign on this little trivet. That's where I keep like my soap and my room spray. And then you go back here in our wax warmer, we have a love spell um, from a little local shop here. I am going to get some cookies to put in there as well. And then we have on our blanket ladder, I got that from a little local shop as well. And then we have our little heart, um, our little heart napkin to add that little popper red. I just over put it over the other one because those ones are really thin. So those ones are cute. I think that one's from the Target dollar spot, but they're not like absorbent to use every day. I just moved our spoon trivet there. And then on our oven, we have our um, sign here and then our cute pot. And I can't wait to use it to cook cute dishes this um, season. And then we have that. And then over here, we just added a little heart on that cutting board. And then I have like my wooden spoons and yeah. And then these cute mugs. I usually plug in my electric tea kettle here. So I think the mugs there will be great. I can just grab them and go. For Valentine's Day, any of the holidays, you don't have to replace everything. Just add little pops and you guys will love it. So when I took down Christmas, I kind of styled this, um, a couple weeks ago, was it a week or two ago? And with the thought that I was just gonna add little Valentine's Day touches, but on the top, I just have my scale. And then you guys know I like love houses. So houses and some greenery, candles. On this shelf, I just have like a family picture, some old books, find books at the Vincent Thrift Store. I love to style with books or I, I get books, um, from the dollar store, but these are thrifted. Um, and then I just put in that little heart. It adds, adds a cute pop of red. I have some bakeware and then some greenery there. Next shelf, more houses, love houses, have a little riser there. I added in love nest. I have the R for our last name uh, picture and then uh, one of those moss balls and a little bit of toper. Um, like a rustic. This pot is actually not old. It's from Michael's. It just looks vintage and old. Um, I added uh, this little topiary here. I have a vintage uh, little child's toy. It's like a little car. It's not necessarily Valentine's Day, but I like the little pop of Reddit ads, some greenery, and then houses because I love houses. So that's how this little area is styled. And I like that we have the red just going down the middle, but I think it turned out cute. This hutch is from Target and I've had it a couple years. I was so happy that 
it made it through the move because you know glass it has all that glass on it but it was packed up really well and then our table here i just added the heart trivet and i am going to get some um baby's breath to put in there i think that'll be cute and kind of um spring it up my runner is like kind of an everyday runner and it is from hobby lobby so easy breezy there you go. Oh God, here she comes The woman that I love It's too bad she'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be Cause I hope that I'm not showing How I feel for her But she won't feel the same for me I've got this picture in my mind It's just the two of us Just the two of us But I know I have to try Try to let her go Because she won't I listen when she talks I watch her when she walks She's giving me these feelings that I've never felt before But she will never know That I love her so well She's with somebody else and I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know, na na She will never know, na na Never know, na na. She'll never know. It's like she stole my heart. Okay, entryway. So we have this mirror that I usually have up. That is from Home Goods. That was a gift for my mother in law. But I added in this is a reef that I usually have up all year round. It is from Hobby Lobby. I added in that little metal heart. And then here we have. Um, another lantern you guys know I love houses lanterns and yeah just love love them so another lantern I still need to find something to put in there but we have these candlesticks from Hobby Lobby and then everything here besides this vintage from the um, thrift store this heart but these candles are from Hobby Lobby I like them because they kind of look old and then we have these hearts from Hobby Lobby came in all of that in a pack um we have these books my sister-in-law made me with our family's name on them me and my husband and then the kids and then a family picture we this little trivet thing is from oops the thrift store and then i just have a little plant in there and then down here another candlestick more family pictures and then i put i have this little tray um i think it is from it probably has a tag on it still um michael's yeah it for sure had the tag on it it's from michael's a few years ago love sign and then i put a little heart just to add a pop of red and then the bottom shelf i left as is but i think it's cute same over here i left as is um i redid this area when i took down the christmas so it's pretty good to go and then over here, I just put this little game. If people want to take off their shoes and play a little tic-tac-toe, they can do that as well. But I think it looks good, comfy, cozy, and ready to go. We're going to start off with chicken breast. This is two pounds. So I am doubling the recipe. Sorry, that is, there we go, two pounds. Bowls for a half a cup, but I will have the recipe linked down below um, of hot sauce, but since we are doubling it, I'm gonna do two, uh, one whole cup. 
And I'm just using a little Red Hot like from my local grocery store. Whatever hot sauce you would like. And then for parsley, dried parsley, it calls for one tablespoon, but we're gonna double it and do two. There we go. And one cup of cottage cheese. And like I said, I will have the recipe linked down below. I'm gonna put this on high for four hours and then I will shred the chicken and then we can make wraps with it or we can make little sliders um, with some low carb bread, but an easy recipe. And I think this recipe would be perfect for um, like football season. So for Super Bowl Sunday, perfect recipe and it's lower in calories, so it's good on the waistline. We are up in the play room. So this is your before shot. Brooklyn is just laying out the books. We always like to add in new books for each season. So we have this one, Full Full of Love, The Littlest Valentine. That is one of Brooklyn's favorites, right, Brookie? Yeah. We have The Night Before Valentine's Day, Tiny T-Rex, The Very Fairy Princess, Pinkalicious, Fancy Nancy, Heart to Heart, um, Llama Llama, I Love You, I Love You More, and then I Love You Forever. And these books we're going to add in Brooklyn's room to her book area. Brooklyn's area, um, book area in her room, I added those books to the area. We also have some like standards like the Lorax, the Pout Pout Fish, Llama Llama, Dinosaurs, I Love You, and a few others so that she has a little variety of books there. But yeah. All set up in her book area. <laughs> Here is all the stuff that we're going to use. Um, like I said earlier, we did, I did a whole video like going over all of like a haul. Um, that video I will have linked down below. But we're going with kind of the pink and the red up here. So very cute, very playroom-ish. Um, so there we go. So Brooklyn is getting herself organized, but we are about to start. Um, she is going to start, I think, with her play kitchen. Oh, she painted a picture. Let's show you guys that. So she painted this, what, last week? Yeah. Yeah, and it's super cute, and she put it in her play kitchen as a little backdrop. So we're going to put that back and then she's going to do the play kitchen area first yeah. and then we will move on to the rest of the playroom. I watch you as you dry. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile. Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time Don't you know that Put your favorite song on Just to wait 
um, let's start over here. She has her little um, Valentine's Day ambiance that she picked. And then her garland. And then down here we have a tic-tac-toe game for her to play. And then also in here, these are like stickered hearts. Because she has all of her art stuff in that cabinet. And then here is some like markers and stuff for her to do her art. Over here we have our poofy heart. And then this little love note pillow. That's really cute. We have our fuzzy heart pillow. And then love you more sign there. We have um, this fuzzy blanket and then over here she captured her love gnome so he's in his little little gauge and then we have uh, some felt hearts and she can do patterning and stuff like that with those and then at our kitchen we have made with love there and she can cook her little meals she has her paintings that she made there and then this cute valentine's day striped um, tea towel so that is it guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was pretty jam packed with the recipe and the decorating downstairs, upstairs. So I hope you guys thoroughly enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys very soon with another video. Bye guys. <music>